Hi. Hi, hi, nine viewers. This is Dr. Kavya Priya Vajjala. I'm an obstetrician and gynecologist and a laparoscopic surgeon. Now we are going to discuss how do we calculate ovulation time. Ovulation time calculation is always a retrospective. So you have you, first thing is that the prerequisite is uh, to have a regular cycles. That is either 28 days or 30 days cycle. If your if your cycle is lasting for 28 days. It means you have to minus 14 from the 28. It means the 14th day is the exact day of your ovulation. If your cycle is 30, then you have to minus 14 from 30. It means 16th day is your day of ovulations. So these are the rough calculations. And there are other diagnostic tools how we calculate the ovulation. That is the uh, serum progesterone levels. If your serum progesterone levels is greater than 20 nanomoles per liter, it signifies that you are ovulating. And if your estradiol and LH levels are raised, it means that you are ovulating. These are the serum markers. Other one is the ultrasound. Ultrasound shows the free fluid in the pouch of dog it signifies and there is a, there will be a ruptured follicle it signifies that you have ovulated and also clinically also you can assess how you are ovulating that is you know you can get cervical um, mucus plugs and uh, your basal body temperature raises and uh, you get a uh, little crampy abdominal pain so these are all the clinical signs which signifies that you are ovulating